Hello and welcome to the AO Blitz Social Show. My name is Michael Cashney and joining me with a terrifying t-shirt is Dan Latimer. Terrifyingly fantastic as I like to say. No one else does. Now, the AO Blitz was over in Noosa over the weekend. You can see some of the shots from the Instagram account. Were you up at Noosa, Dan? I wasn't up at Noosa, but our team was. I asked them to bring back some sand for me. They unfortunately did not. Oh. And in other news, the Davis Cup World Group qualifications were held over the weekend. We've got a shot here of uh, two guys playing uh, their version of the Davis Cup in their driveway. These guys uh, tweeted us this photo of them playing a little bit of driveway tennis before they were waiting for the broadcast to start of the Davis Cup. Up in Shepparton, where coincidentally the AO Blitz will be this weekend. There's a bit of, yeah. It's a nice coincidence. Yeah. But in other news, the, uh, the Spanish team, look at them. They're, they're, we've got a shot of them here. Suave in their suits. Elegant, refined, sophisticated, and they won. They did win. Yeah. True Spanish Armada. Now I would like to contrast that with <laughs> the Australians who also won um, in tracky dax. They did, but I think in, the tr in true Australian style, the way that they've topped this off is uh, by putting thongs on as well, which I really like. Winners. 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 True winners. Yeah. Now, I've got a shot here of Pat Rafter um, with the Fanatics. So, the winners in the Tracky Dax and Thongs celebrated as Australians should. Yeah, with a little bit of champagne and, you know, when in Poland, pop a champagne and spray it over people on a tennis court. I don't think that's the saying. Well, and also, we've got, we've got a video here of 20-year-old uh, Bernie Tomic with 68-year-old Tony Roach, which is probably my favourite bit of content to come out of the Davis Cup. Yeah, I really loved this one. It's uh, Bernard and uh, Tony Roach uh, trying out a new handshake um, that they put together on tour. What I really love about this is that it, at the end, Tomic sort of bounces off Tony Roach rather than the other way around. Tony Roach is such a dude. He's like a, uh, a brick wall of, <laughs> of a man. And now Serena Williams has got a new uh, Twitter interactive experience thing. Yeah, I was looking at the trailer earlier on. It's called In My Shoes. And from what I can gather, it's... Uh, following Serena around as she goes on tour and it allows fans to interact with her. So keep an eye on that. Keep an eye on that one. Start following her to find out what that one's about. You know what you just did? What? You gave me a segue Ooh, I love that. to the social show selection where we run through some of the accounts you should be following and first up is Serena Williams. 3.9 million followers on her Twitter account. Why should people be following her? Not only because she has this new interactive show coming up, but also she does a thing called uh, hashtag Serena Fridays, where people can ask her any question on a Friday and she'll be on hand to answer it. Next up, Laura Robson. Why should people be following Laura on her Instagram? Well, like most of these young players, they're really using social media to share what they're up to on tour. Laura Robson, no exception. She likes to share a little bit of behind the scenes, such as uh, she's currently sharing coffee cups from Starbucks uh, that have the wrong name on it. Such as? Such as Laura with an O, not a U. Yeah. It's a different vowel, Michael. It's a different name. Uh, it is. Uh, also Lola, not uh, her name either. No. There's a song about that. There is. We can't play it for co anyway. So we've also got uh, Richard Branson, who is who is with Laura Robson in this photo. Yeah. Three point four million followers on Twitter. He's not a tennis player, while well, he is, but not professionally. No. But why should people be following him? Well, he's not a tennis player, but he does have his own tennis tournament, which is pretty cool on a uh, tropical island with probably beautiful sand that we'll never see, touch, or smell. Ah. Well, that is all for the AO Blitz social show for this week. Make sure you uh, watch the Tennis Australia YouTube and. Some Subscribe to get all your updates on the Blitz as it travels around Australia. That's all for this week. See you next time. Bye.